And there we go. All right, so we can get rid of that. You're drinking, drinking from your Strictos mug? Yeah. By the way, here's the Strictos mug. I don't know if this will focus. There we go. And it says, there we go. <laughs> you can get it from strictos.com slash store, as well as shirts. Uh, there's like a really cool shirt that I designed that I haven't like promoted at all. I suck at marketing, but yeah. I should probably like tweet about it at least. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna upgrade everything to maglev in one go. So let's try to be relatively careful with this. So this is how I do this stuff. So all of this is maglev now. Let's go down here. Now all of this is maglev. So that's pretty good. Except for obviously the depots where all the trains are. Uh, and also, yeah. Uh, I think depots do get upgraded to maglev when, when you have them like that, but... So here's usually how I go about doing things. I would put a depot here, a maglev depot. And... Uh, I think... Well, first of all, let's see what we want. I wish that uh, there were, like, non-cargo, like, no passenger deep uh, my cliffs. I might need to add add some cargo ones because, you know, eventually I want to add some cargo maglev stuff. But for now, we only have regular trains, unfortunately. Anyways, uh, let's sort by cost because uh, these are all pretty fast already. So I don't think that should be an issue, but I do want the cheapest options. Uh, let's see. So I'm guessing this one is the most expensive. Wow, these are actually not super expensive. 60,000, okay, so the, uh, is this the, um, what is this? This looks like the Shinkansen, yeah, it's Japanese, right, okay. So wait, so this one is the most expensive? Oh, this is the cost. I want I want uh, running cost. There we go. Now that makes more sense. So this one is the most expensive to run. This one not so much. How much is this costing me? Running cost forty six. Dude, that's not that much more expensive. Fifty four. I kind of like these German ones. Um, uh, though this Japanese one looks pretty nice too. Uh, top speed on this one is 201, so we want anything, we want something that's like a little faster than that. Dude, 500, 505, 450. This, I think I want to go with this one. I kind of like this uh, Transrapid 07. Uh, and 200 passengers, okay. So, let's go total capacity 260. Oh, we're going to fit so, so many things in here. In fact, we can have like shorter trains now. So we can have this and we can have like maybe even three tiles, why not? Uh, we're gonna need two males probably. So let's get rid of that. Let's take a look at the statistics. I wanna compare these two. So, so we have 200 bags of mail and 400 passengers and we're not even taking up the entire length of the train. So that's like amazing. That's super good. So, um, so we have that. If we go to, to this, I think it will inherit all of the things except the groups, right? I don't think it will inherit the groups. What are the orders for this one? This one goes to Hamburg, so this should be on the Hamburg group. Capital City North, okay. And we have one, two, three, four, five, six of them. So let's just, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. And ungroup trains. Oh, we have a lot of ungroup trains. Okay, so that's not good. Uh, how do we go about this? Mm. 
because I, I, I want to like get rid of all these now like in one go I guess I can just do this sell this one go to this one uh, train 19 sell this one as well this one is train 12 which is not on this list so we're not gonna delete it yet train 40 Oh, it's this depot. So train 40, we get rid of it. Train 18, it's on this depot. We get rid of it. It's kind of manual work, unfortunately, but yeah. Oh, so it's on this one. So 16 goes away, and then 17, which is here. Perfect, all right, so we go to ungroup trains, and we put these on this group. We should have should have done first and then clone them, but when you don't do this that often, you kind of forget. Look at the speeds. Some maglevs are commuter trains with a max speed like 120. I think the, I mean I checked the speed on this one. I thought it was like super fast, like 450. Also, it looks like it's trapped here for some reason. Oh, because the station is not converted to maglev. Okay. that That's kind of an issue. Why was this converted to maglev? There we go. They're so pretty. And we have room to, like, keep expanding them, which is awesome. And also, we're going to make it, like, nice modern station. I know, um... I can't remember who like commented on my old brick bridges here, but we're gonna make this like like one of those like international like Eurostar type stations. I have I have some assets for that, but let's let's continue with our upgrade process here. So uh, let's see. Let's take a look at the Chicago ones. So we're gonna go. Uh, let's find out. So this is train 21. Okay, fine. Let's go to this depot. Uh, Transrapid 07. And we had a configuration of... Actually, I could have just do this instead. Clone train. No trains here. There we go. So this train is clone, is not it's ungrouped, right? It's not ungrouped, it's already on the Hamburg group again. So we're gonna move this one to Chicago. Uh we're gonna go to the orders, we're gonna get rid of all the orders, and instead we're gonna clone the orders of train uh twenty-one, which is good. And at this point we wanna clone it four times. And off you go. That's actually much faster. So now we can delete train 21. Uh, what else? Train 20, which is also here. Train 22. And 23. And that's one more group. That is all converted. So then we have uh, Porto to Capital. Good. So let's take care of that. Um, we're going to clone... You, which, yeah, you're there, so port to the capital. Now you're in this group. Uh, let's hide all these uh, windows here. Uh, this is train 15, right? Okay, cool. So let's go into the orders, get rid of all these orders. Go to here. Perfect, so you have all the orders there, and we're gonna clone you three times. In fact, we might not eat that third one, to be honest. Because now we have so much more capacity that and speed that it just wouldn't even matter, but which is fine. So off you go. So this is train 15, should be deleted. Train 13 should be deleted, and train 12, which is in a different depot, most likely. Train 12, great. All right, one more group. We're almost done, we're almost done. Are the other station connected to Maglev? Uh, yeah, I've, I've upgraded everything. 
So yeah, all these stations are indeed connected to the MacLev uh, network, as you can see here. I mean, we, we have to do a lot of work here, by the way. Just don't don't judge just yet. We're gonna we're gonna make all this look amazing in just a minute. See how we've been streaming for about an hour, dude. We got so much done in like an hour. That's amazing. I love it. I love it. Uh, at some, I might actually split this. This uh, once I upload this to YouTube, I might split it into like two parts. So that, because usually when I upload like a three hour live stream, people tell me like, oh, I don't have the time, but they do have the time to like watch five videos of 30 minutes each, which is the same thing. You can pause the video and watch it later. That's fine. <laughs> you can also, I highly encourage you to watch these streams at like one and a half speed, because otherwise it's just like too much. <laughs> okay, um, going back to the depot here. So clone this train, which, is on this group, so we want to put you on Reykjavik, and uh, we're gonna get rid of all of these things. You're gonna have these orders, and we're gonna clone you four times, like so. And off you go, and I think that was the last group, right? So we can get rid of 24, 25, and 27 in one go, sweet. And where's this one? This one is here. Get rid of that. And finally, we're gonna upgrade all of the other depots to Maglev. Like that, and like that. And now we're gonna start refactoring things. Jaren, how's it going? Good evening to you as well. I mean, to, to me it's still good morning, but I, yeah. <laughs> you can listen to a video while you're working too. Yeah, well, I guess, yeah, I mean, I don't know. So I, I do listen to like a lot of videos when I work, but they're usually like either podcasts or interviews and things like that. Like a game like OpenTTD, like I kind of want to look at it more than I want to listen to it. In fact, I would find myself watching like City Skylines videos that I would mute the commentary and like listen to some other thing. <laughs> But yeah, that works. Um, so what's uh, going on here? Broken down, okay, I see. So we need to get rid of this depot ASAP. Actually, we need to redo this whole thing. Okay, so let's, let's focus on the station for a second here. Uh, by the way, how are we doing? Dude, we're still growing, five months in a row. Even with that big uh, sort of uh, idle time. You're loading, unloading. Uh, oh, we have like a massive backup here. What's the reliability on these trains? Dude, it's not that great. I think I've screwed that up. Let's see if we can like improve this. So this is what we have. Reliability 89. I mean, shouldn't be that bad. This is 94. This is 77, so that's way worse. What about the Japanese one? 92 and 94. I think I think we should go with this one, honestly. What about this one? This is a commuter train, which is not as fast. I know that. Also not as fast. Not as fast. Not as fast. These are definitely slower. So I think this is the way to go. You know what, Let, screw it. Let's just upgrade all of these to the uh, TransRapid 08 that have a significantly higher reliability. And in the meantime, let's let's uh, see what we can do about this station. So we're gonna need, uh, I think, uh, CD stations. Yeah, we're gonna do one of these. That, the problem with these stations is that they like, they they block the, the underneath like, you can't see the actual trains running, which kind of bugs me a little bit, but it's uh, it's fine. We can do, like, half, like, we can do, like, maybe three tiles covered and then the rest uncovered. Something like that. So, we can have it be like that. And then we can have it be maybe four tiles. No. 
Wait, is this actually connecting? Yeah, okay. So we can do this. And then at the end, we can have, let's do red because all of our new trains are going to be red. So we can do that. We don't need this station. So we can do this and we can do do that. Maybe this and then that. I don't, I can't tell the difference. These two look exactly the same, but they're not the same. Oh, cause these are like middle platform. And the other one is, is, is not. Actually, I don't mind that. That, that will give us like, like an interesting. So what about this? Like a gradient maybe of sorts. Is there anything else? So wait, let's do this. Actually, I kind of like this. So it goes from like fat to like thin to like in between. I'm trying to like quickly like upgrade chunks of my station. There we go, cool. Let's see how this looks. Uh, we might have to do it one at a time because yeah, I don't want to disrupt the service too much. Like that. And then... I guess these bottom end ones can be easily upgraded like that. In fact, these... Uh, so we said we had six, so maybe we can do... We can do something like that just to make it, you know, a bit more. A bit more interesting. I know that I have more pieces than this. Don't I? What about this? Hmm. No, that doesn't look great. That doesn't look great, sorry. Uh. I kind of like it more when it was like this here 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 comes the indecisiveness of it all oh wait i can do this perhaps just to like have a cleaner look or maybe on the ends and then have this there that's nicer so let's uh do this and this this and this oh now these these don't make that much sense anymore Don't they? <laughs> Something like that. It's kind of like a th huge thing, but I don't know. I kind of like it. Aren't the vehicles simply bunched up? That's why their backup happened. Uh, I think uh, there was like a broken train and everything was waiting and yeah, I mean, we need to like rework this whole thing. So, uh, I mean, there there's multiple reasons why this is all messed up, but we'll, we'll, we'll get there, we'll get there. Uh, hi, Mr. Streamer, nice to see you live once. There's some time zone differences to Finland making it difficult to spot a wild street tester. Well, welcome, I'm glad you made it. Uh, I try to, I do my best to stream in my morning, um, so that, you know, it's like early evening-ish in Europe, uh, so yeah, hopefully, hopefully this helps, but if I stream at the time that I actually wanted to stream, which would be like my evenings, then it would be easily like, I don't know, 4 a.m. in Europe, maybe like early morning, Sunday, who wants to wake up on a Sunday morning, Are you nuts? Okay, so let's be smart about this. And by smart, let's be super dumb about this. I need to like do some planning here because uh, this is gonna start affecting a lot of things. So I want Chicago, I want, first of all, I wanna increase Chicago because look, look at the thing that we have here. I wanna extend this station at multiple platforms and have the tracks maybe come from this side. 
So we'll have to delete a whole bunch of Chicago, which kind of sucks because, um, yeah, it's going to take a little while for us to do that. Let's start with the simple things because they're going to hate me, like, very rapidly. So what if I do this? And that's about it. So let's just start buying land. We're going to slowly demolish the entire city. And uh, we're going to have to drive the crap out of these people. The Chicagoans, obviously. Using the Japanese station set. I mean, I, th I guess these are Japanese. I honestly have no idea. Just uh, th these are like the city stations. So, yeah. As I've used them here too, by the way. This looks actually pretty nice. Oh, I kind of want that like huge like hanger in the middle. How can I do that? How the crap did I do that? Oh, I think if I go like this. Will that give me? No. How do you get the big curvy thing? It has to be one of these, right? Actually, this might look nice here, <laughs> but no, no. Change that back. Come on, let me do it. Especially because I just literally block the the path. There we go. Cool. Um, yeah, I don't know how I did that. Maybe it's this one. Yeah, there it is. Okay. So because we did that, we can now do this, perhaps. So that looks actually way nicer, I think. And you can also see the trains inside, which is. What I hate about these stations that cover the roof, where you can actually see what's happening. So, boom, boom, and you're done. Okay, so increased stations, uh, train station size is done. So we have three lanes each now. Uh, let's just uh, branch them out like this. I would like to try to stay as uh, leveled as possible. Middle track looks shorter. The trains stop at the beginning now. Middle tracks look shorter. Uh, hang on, let me switch to... What is it? Transparency options. Uh, so... You know, everything looks good. I think that comment was like when I placed that like thing and it stopped in the middle. Yeah, but no, we're, we're, we're good. Uh, actually... That might be better. Yeah, there we go. That's better. And also we see the gray thing. Cool. By the way, you can uh, you can change uh, your transparency options. So you have, like, if you hold control, for example, it will, like, lock it in place. So it won't, when you press X, which is what I'm pressing now to, like, toggle between, uh, you know, transparency and not transparency, uh, it will not affect these things. So... But if I get rid of the little uh, lock icon there, now they do get uh, hidden. And this uh, button here controls whether it's like only the shadows or the whole thing. Just in case you didn't know. Same for trees. But that's what I actually want, so. Uh, so this train, it's not going to the end of the station. Not entirely sure why. Also, we've been replacing trains and these blue ones are still there, so I don't know what's up with that. I guess I should probably send them to servicing as well. Um, let's go into... Manage list, replace vehicles. Oh, I think I only did it to one group, that's probably why. That should take care of things. All right. Uh, how the hell do I want to do this? Is Chicago liking me again already? I mean, mediocre. Yeah. Kinda. No, not enough. Okay, fine. Local authority. Bribe. Bribe. Oh, 
almost there. So I want to have four tracks here. And actually, let's go back to transparency settings for a second, because I, I don't want to... How do I... I specifically don't want... Oh, these are signs. Not, um, not these guys. The purchase land. How do I avoid the purchase land thing? Is it this one? Yeah, it's this one. All right, so we're going to lock that in place. Sweet. Well, those are similar, but not exactly. Uh, three essentially done the same look. Now track two. Yeah, there's something odd about this track. But, like, I mean, I see the track below. I don't understand why. Like, I... Uh, It'll, I mean, it's not shorter. Like, I see I see the whole chunk. Of, I mean... Far end. Like, why is this station not going the whole way there? It's like these tiles are not a station? I mean, yeah, there could be a buffer, but, like, I don't see it. It's, like, visually not there. Here, let's hide the station altogether. That's, like, a segment of track straight up. Oh, I guess this technically is a sec. Oh, I see what the problem is. Again, this is why I don't like these types of stations, because you can't see what's going on in there. So, what about... Is this one the one we had? Let's see if that fixes it. Nope. That didn't fix it. What about this one? Let's see when the next train comes in. If any. Transparency doesn't help with buffers, those tracks underneath them. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I can I can see that. I can see that now. It's confusing. But yeah. Uh, come on, give me a train here. God dang it. So I guess these are buffers? I mean, they don't look like buffers. I guess uh, the, the name literally says buffer. Fine. Uh, buffer, buffer, buffer. Hmm. How... So wait, so what is this then? Station Hall. Oh, I guess I only upgraded that one. No, so it is working. Okay, so that should take care of things, right? Come on, let's see about this train. Go all the way, go all the way. Yes, there we go. Um, the names, Street Toaster, what do they mean? I don't know what, what names? You mean my name? It's not, it's not like two names. Or, but I don't know if you're referring to something on the screen, so, yeah, not sure. Cool, okay. Um, let's go, let's go full, full throttle here for a sec. Um, if I continue this path like that, that's as far as we can go. That's okay. So we have these super long tunnels here, which I am not a huge fan of because then we have a large block here. Kind of want to get rid of this farm. But I don't think I need to. Uh, let's let's figure this out without deleting things. So these two branches are gonna go. Actually, in the meantime, let's just uh, do this and do that. Uh, 
uh, wrong thing. Right thing. And right thing. There we go. So I'm, I'm, I'm just like experimenting here. Just give me a second because I'm not entirely sure what I want to do. I think I want these three tracks to be connected and then and those will be like the nor northern no the eastern branches because this is the east this is the west north and south something like that <laughs> it was a play on the numbers mason and the buffer i have no idea what you're talking about <laughs> i did not get that reference whatsoever but I, I I appreciate it. How big is Capital City? Not super big. Because it's not growing. Why is it not growing? I would like to know. What are we short? Are we short on goods again? Why are we short on goods? We're delivering a crap ton of goods. So we have three tr trains that are kind of waiting there. Um, how are we doing on chemicals here? We're doing good. We have one train loading at any given time. Something... I mean, we were delivering an excess of goods a minute ago, so I don't know exactly what's happening. But it is not growing. And we'll have to take care of that. But let's first, like, fix this. One thing at a time, people. This looks like a fancy station now. Um, okay, so... So we have those two branches, which means that these two tracks should go this way if we're going to follow the same pattern. Look at me just destroying half a mountain. Cool, there we go. Yeah, lots of trains just waiting around, which is ultimately what I want to see. I want to have at least one or two trains always waiting for things. Uh, but it's possible that we just hit this at a time where like the ticker didn't update. But no, we're, we're really short. So in the next uh, actual episode, I will probably focus on, on this because I feel like this is just going to take a bunch of time, way more than the time that we've been spending doing other things. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Oh, by the way, this is uh, not good for a different reason now. Man, I really want to get rid of that stupid farm there. It's in the middle. Farm is in the middle. Because this... I want it to be lower like that. Am I be able to push this forward? No. So now we have two sets of tunnels that are pretty long, unfortunately. At least they're symmetric, so that's something. We can do that just for good measure. Um, but I wish that that wasn't the case here. Uh, I tried your configuration a few days ago. Thanks for the tutorial on how to set it up, by the way. Uh, and yeah, it's not so easy to get to 10k. I know, everything, like, the more you grow, the harder it gets. Uh, which, you know, that's like every, it's literally every game in the world is like that, usually. But, uh, I don't know, it's kind of an interesting challenge, I guess. So, yeah, over here we have to, like, stop this at some point. I wonder if we can just um, divert some of these trains while I fix this connection, perhaps? Maybe that would make some kind of sense. Do it in chunks. We have a lot of trains waiting here. Uh, is Chicago still hitting us? Possibly. No, we're good. We're good, you say? Yeah, let's delete more of you, then. <laughs> That's how it works. Can I get rid of... Oh, we can get rid of some of these, too. I guess not that many. 
Uh, might as well buy that and let's just buy all of this land because I'm pretty sure I wish that I can click and drag this But uh, pretty much we're gonna need this entire space Chicago, I'm so sorry, but that's just gonna be What's gonna happen? Uh, one thing we could do in the meantime if we're gonna disrupt this entire thing is put an airport so that at least our passenger Situation gets better, but I mean since we're not delivering goods anyways, I guess it doesn't matter. Um, yeah, so let me... This is the hardest part of uh, this game, trying to like, set this stuff up. So let's do like a, like a pretty bad uh, connection here. Thankfully, this is still, like, at the same level, so that's good. And, uh, just temporarily, I think we're gonna go here. I wanna make, like, a temporary connection here, and that way I can split these two branches, north and south. Uh, sorry, east and west. I keep saying north and south. Let's, let's put labels, because, yeah. So this will be the western branch. No, wrong. That's the eastern branch. <laughs> there we go. And then this is the western branch. Cool. So these three lanes will be western. These three other lanes will be the eastern. I Whatever. You you see you know what I mean. Hopefully. I like the fire and gives people something to look at. <laughs> yeah, it gives people something to smell too. If you know what I mean. <laughs> Pretty sure you know what I mean. Uh so we're a little elevated here. Which uh could be a problem. But I guess that yeah, that's not that big of a deal per se. We could actually, you know what, in here we can go higher. Why not? Just stay at the level that we're gonna stay for the rest of the, uh, of the track. So, just for good measure, let's extend this like so. And that will give us a shorter bridge, uh, sorry, a shorter tunnel. And then we can do something like this, perhaps. There we go. That looks nice. Uh, this is gonna obviously go away. So do not mind that. In fact, uh, yeah, we're not ready yet to get rid of that. Also, let's get rid of this depot. And just finally set this up. There we go. I feel like it will be easier to connect the western branch first, so let's isolate things real quick. Let's quickly connect this like so. Actually, let's do that and that. Let's put that in there and temporarily put that in there. And this is gonna be a terrible quick connection so that trains don't get... Actually, well, that bridge was not super good, right? By docked. Yeah, the speed on these ones is just terrible. So concrete. I guess that concrete one is pretty fast, so we'll keep that. Uh, and uh, that's gonna be that. And that's gonna be that. And uh, over here, we're gonna do this we're gonna do that let's put a one-way path right about there get this ugly bridge in here again all of this is going to be removed and made pretty but for now i just want to start separating the trains that way i can work on one branch without disrupting the service on the other one 
There we go. Okay. So all of this is connected. We are going to need some signals. So let's go ahead and do that. So we have all signals going all the way. I can honestly just do this. Come on, turn around, turn around. All right, so this is done. I think everything is right. Uh, sort of. Um, so how do I make it? So th these are obviously coming on this one. Oh, but they could be on this branch that's not really connected to the other one. Oh, this is gonna be a problem. Okay, we're gonna disable this branch now. This platform is not gonna be used. Yeah, now we're gonna get a lot of lost trains, but I guess it's fine. We can just do this. And keep using our old branch. Sorry, I'm like all over the place here, but I'm trying to like figure this out. Okay, um, what will it take to get the other trains on the right branch? So maybe this. So that kind of works. <laughs> I feel like there's a crash that's about to happen here and it's not gonna be fun. And now we have a giant block here that is uh, no good. Yeah, so you're stuck there, but now you have one way out. I think I finally get rid of that, perhaps? And perhaps I can also now finally do this. Do we have any more trains that need to go this way? I don't think so, but we're finally separating things. Hey, Arthurus, how's it going? Oh, I didn't notice that was you who commented before. Holy crap. Um, well, uh, have a good uh, dinner, I hope. Or lunch. No, yeah, lunch. No, dinner, probably. Thanks for sticking around, and we'll, we'll, we'll do another SmackDown uh, soon, <laughs> most likely. Uh, hello from Turkey. Hello, Turkey. How's it going? The entirety of the country of Turkey, hello. Hopefully... You are enjoying. I, I'm. I'm pretty sure that many of you in the chat are just waiting for me to like screw something up and have like one fireball of an explosion of things. I think it's just a matter of a a matter of a, a minute here. All right. All right. All right. So, let's see. Uh, Mark Singh, thank you for the host. Uh, oh, so wait. So this train, where, where do you want to go? You want to go to Reykjavik. Why can't you take that path? Because that path doesn't exist. It now it does. That's the one thing about maglevs. It's just you can't really see the connections. It's kind of tricky. Okay, so things are looking uh, pretty good so far, if I do say so myself. 
I want to maybe get rid of this and get rid of this. In fact, these two middle branches, let's just get rid of all of them. So now it's like two each, which is fine for now. And uh, yeah, so let's also get rid of this. So these two will be separated. And uh, how do we make it so that this bridge goes to the middle? I'm trying to figure out what the best way is to actually hook this all up. So those are path signals there. That's good. Where is that train going? Nowhere. Why, why did you even go that way? Okay, here's, here's where bad things are about to happen. Oh my God, that was so close. Okay, let's let's time it. Let's time it after this one. Go, 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 go. No. Oh, there's a signal in the middle. Okay, fine. Now you go. No. I actually want to get rid of this one. Because, uh, yeah, this is going to cause some issues. Cool. All right. Um, so I was able to separate these two. This is where we're at. Uh, we're getting the eastern branch properly going to these two uh, terminals. And we're getting the western branch, which has significantly less trains uh, on these two. What we need to do next is connect this third platform so that trains are not super backed up in here. And uh, then we're going to start reworking the entry point into Chicago. We're slowly but surely deleting buildings. Uh, here, let's keep doing this because I want to I want the branch to sort of come this way and then exit this way just so that it's a, a little prettier than this. And especially because we want to add we want to add, sorry, two extra platforms in there. So let's get rid of that real quick. Actually, let's get rid of these. Local authority doesn't like it anymore. Something there was available. There we go. Cool. So uh, yeah, we're slowly but surely buying property here uh, while Chicago likes us and, and whatnot. We can probably even boost that by having a ferry service between these two, but there's such a large backup here. I don't know if adding one extra track will actually help, but there's one way to find out. So, let me think here for, for a moment. Um, I wonder if I can just, uh, so, so this would have to be something like this, right? And right now I won't let me because there's a signal here. So we'll have to put another path signal in there and get rid of this one. Oh, that was so scary. But that means that uh, this train has to go like across all the other lanes in order to, to get to the exit, which could be a problem. Most likely will be a problem, actually. So get rid of that. I mean, it's getting a little better, but it's still not amazing. Hey, Dolphin, how's it going? 
Uh, am I reaching all three terminals? Like, okay, there we go. So, and that train is going the wrong way, of course. But now we should go the right way. And here, we need one of these. Uh, let me change the transparency settings. We want factories to be not invisible, just there we go, semi-transparent, so that we can see what's what's happening behind. Oh, but what we can do, though, is have this exact same train station entrance, so trains can choose to go this way or that way, but they all exit through the middle, so we no longer need this track, but we do need these two, I guess, feeder tracks, and like that. So trains can either, yeah, I like uh, this is this is the way to go. This is it. Uh, so definitely the exit has to be the middle track, which means that we'll have to move all this one tile over. Yikes! It's gonna be fine. How am I doing? I'm doing uh, pretty good. Just trying to figure out what uh, the best way is to deal with all of the trains. But so far, it seems like uh, we're in good shape. Uh, we're not doing amazing, but we're not doing as bad. Uh, let me double check, because we have some uh, some trains that need some love here. Uh, the goods ones, particularly. So let's uh, take care of that real quick. Replace vehicles. Uh, we're going to do... I think it was this one, right? The one we're using? Oh, man, this is like way more expensive. Um... What about something like this? 170, jeez, these are like really expensive. 150. Even like the bad ones are not that, <laughs> that good. Uh, 96 kilometers an hour. So this one is like pretty slow and it's not, yeah. I mean, this is pretty much our only option right now. Not gonna lie, it's not a great option, but it's our only option. So let's just send everything for servicing. That should help out a little bit. Uh, what else? Do we have anything else that's not sorted? Oh, we forgot to uh, group these trains. So these are all the chemical trains. I'm pretty sure. So, uh, sorry, let's go to orders real quick. Yeah, so these, uh, capital city goods, do we even have fruit, goods? Tijuana Chemicals, this is the group. Okay, so Tijuana Chemicals. Is there a way to, like, add them to a group straight up, like, in one go? No. That's all right. There we go. All right, so that's pretty good. So last year they all made a profit. How are actually how are we doing in terms of profit in general? So profit last year. Holy crap! These maglev trains are making us quite a bit of money. Uh, let's sort in descending order. So these iron ore train not doing super hot, but only we have like three trains that didn't make any money. The Salt Lake City one, I might like ditch this one soon because it's like not doing anything for us. Like the type of income that it's generating is not enough to justify even bothering with it. And I thought it was gonna grow Salt Lake City. It's this train, by the way. It's this little branch right here. It's really not doing anything, unfortunately. In any case, uh, let's get this fixed once and for all. So I kind of want to replicate the same design. I want to even have it uh, like some like this, like mirrored. Stop. There we go. So I want to. So this is the exit path. Uh, let's do a concrete bridge, like that. 
Wait, no, this is not the exit path. Actually, this is the new exit path, so... That means that this should actually go this way instead. And we're gonna get rid of this. And all of this. Like so. So I think I got that right. And unfortunately we can't get a tunnel there, so we'll have to push this two tiles like so. There we go. And uh, do that and do that. Okay, um, so, hang on, let's just get rid of this segment for a second here. So, incoming trains should temporarily <laughs> go here. Oh my god, this is such a terrible connection, but yeah. Oh boy. How did that happen? Oh, because we have this. So now that shouldn't happen anymore. So this is the entryway now. <laughs> uh, that was bound to happen. Uh, quickly, which are these two trains? Let's uh, clone them real quick. Hold control so that they stay in their groups and everything is fine and you just everything is fine don't worry about it don't don't you worry about it do we get the notification train crash 358 die in a fireball after collision <sighs> that's good that's pretty good um so what are we doing we're uh sorry i'm kind of lost track of that we're trying to split I mean, we already have split these uh, eastern branches and western branches so that they go to each particular uh, platform. And uh, we're trying to work the exits now, like basically retrofactor, retrofit or refactor, uh, basically this giant spaghetti of tracks so that they look nice and neat and all that good stuff. So that's what we're doing, in case you were uh, wondering. I kind of maybe want to... Get rid of all of this for a second. There we go. And go full flat here. Maybe get rid of this. Get rid of this. And do that. And we're gonna need some extra signals in there. Fan freaking tastic. We can maybe get rid of this one. We don't know that one also notice that not every train has to make money feeder services for example yeah i know i know i know um that's that's very true not every train needs to uh, needs to make money but it's nice if most of them do because uh, the running costs sort of keep adding up and uh they could come and bite you in uh, the rear end if you know what i mean all right so that Fireball is cleared. I think we need those now. And get rid of this. So this is the exit. I want to avoid having more of these issues. So why is this train not able to exit? Should be going... Oh, because the signals are the wrong way, of course. We'll get that sorted out in a second, guys. Give me a moment. There we go. Now it's all good. Uh, why is the signal? Oh, because I know why.
There we go. So that should sort of work itself out. Famous last words. Look at that. Everything is super nice and everything is flowing and all the good stuff. Yeah, I guess the people, yeah, ping, ping the net is right. Who, whoever wanted an explosion, just gave you an explosion. So, how do we move forward from this? Let's see, Chicago still liking us? Yes, let's delete some more, more of them buildings. Uh, let's see. No, that's it. What about the road? Can we delete the road? We cannot delete the road. Uh, what else? Maybe we can delete some of these outer buildings? No. Just in case. Let's keep buying all of this. I don't think we need that much, but it doesn't hurt. In fact, let's just keep buying all this stuff because I have no idea where this track is going to go. And I want to avoid having Chicago grow any further than this. We're going to encapsulate Chicago. And it's going to be great. In fact, let's just buy all of this land just in case. If nothing grew already over here, I'm sure it won't, but... Better be safe than sorry. And we'll have to do the same with Reykjavik. So that's going to be interesting. Let's see, can we finally get this branch to be the one that connects us to the outside is what I would like to know. In order to do so, we will first have to reconciliate our efforts in here. So we can do that. We don't need this track anymore. This can go this way. We can do that. Let's just put a signal there just in case. I don't think we need it, but you know, it doesn't hurt. And now we need this one here. And we can get rid of this, and we can get rid of this, and this. And that. And now we need that. Okay, so, so far so good. We can finally get rid of all of this. And all of this. Uh, we're kind of short on depots, but we'll take care of that in just a second. And now we can finally get rid of all these things. Uh, maybe not that. Let's just use this tool instead. There we go. Isn't this so much prettier already? <laughs> uh, actually, we can stay elevated here. We need to go down, up and down already. So let's let's make sure that that's uh, you know efficient. Boing. There we go. That's much nicer. Way nicer. In fact, if we can get this here. Can you go down now? Okay, so we can have this tunnel here and apply a similar treatment on this side so we can stay elevated for a longer period of time and then we get a shorter tunnel. I mean, this is like micro, like 
yeah, micromanagement to like an absurd degree. But now we have symmetric tracks, which is ultimately what everyone wants. And by everyone, I mean just probably me. Cool. Okay. So, make depots great again, I, I guess. Yeah, we, we need to make some kind of depot edge area somewhere. But look at that, the choreography of trains just like all going into their branches and like everything is like super smooth and it's amazing and it's great. Uh, we have a bunch of lost trains apparently. Why are they lost? They shouldn't though. Oh yes, yes they are. <laughs> they most certainly are lost because I forgot to connect that. There we go. Now they should no longer be lost. But eventually the approach to Chicago should be around here, so yeah. That's gonna take some time. See if we can keep removing some of these things. We cannot. That's fine. More trains are getting old. RCT Form, uh, good afternoon to you. How are you doing? Man, I really like how this came out. Just wish the capital city would be growing. Oh, it is growing! Damn! How are we doing? So goods, we're barely there, I think. Passengers were like exceeding all expectations, which is also super good. Um, alcohol, uh, we're doing pretty good. We have 94% uh, storage there. Yeah, goods were like hanging by a thread. But I guess we'll get there eventually. This train is losing a ton of money, but it's okay. It's so slow though. I think at some point it might be easier to like have a train that's half as long, but twice as fast so that we can have like a cycle of iron ore delivering it to, to here. Um, you forgot to connect that new tunnel. Did I? <laughs> I did. I sure did. So I think Th fixing this branch will be easier than uh, than doing something else right now. So we can slowly get rid of uh, some of these old tracks. Ah, uh, stupid Chicago, it's growing too fast. We need to make sure that they don't. Uh, actually, I don't think I'm gonna need all of this room here, but again, just in case it's it's worth it. Cause I want this line to sort of go straight. And um, can we delete this road? Yes, we can. All right, so. Come on, Chicago. Let me do things. Uh, let's get some trees for you in here. Because why not? What about now? Do you still hate me? Mediocre. Yeah, that's not going to allow me to lead buildings, but I can do this. And now we're good. So. We can do that. Can we. Basically, this is where the new track is going to come in. It's going to be merged with uh, this one. Or maybe even here. That might be better. That way it's like a straight line. Yeah, I like that. So this is the new line. Hope you're ready for more uh, fireballs, because uh, at the rate I'm doing things, it's just bound to happen any mo any moment now. Can I get rid of the bridges? I'm most likely not gonna need all this areas here. Just I'm buying it because I don't know how this track is gonna be laid out. But this is no longer needed. And all that looks good. So 
right here. So we're two levels up. I think we need to go two levels down. Can't keep deleting more routes. I guess I can delete some of them. That's good. I wish that there was like a easier way to, you know, to flatten a city out. <laughs> I mean, I know there is, uh, but um, it's it's like annoying having to like wait because I, I I I mean I honestly I could bribe it a bit more, but eventually they're gonna. If you do it too often, then the city sort of like doesn't like you, and then you're screwed. All right, we're getting there. Slowly but surely. I think we can uh, start laying down the track that we want. Can I get rid of that? I cannot. So I perhaps want to do... This turn is a little bit sharp, so I would like to maybe not be so sharp. In fact, it could just go diagonally like this. There's no reason why it doesn't have to. And of course I can delete that. <laughs> So trains coming from uh, Hamburg will take this turn and it wouldn't necessarily go this way. So is that really even a big deal? I don't necessarily think so. Uh, when I was uh, playing a long time ago, I could not figure out how to get the Maglev track trains. Uh, so I don't know exactly what the problem you were having is, but basically these are like incompatible with one another. So you either do everything Maglev or you do everything rail. If you do rail, you can convert back to maglev. I think you can convert both ways, but the trains needs to be specifically for maglev or specifically for rail. You, you can you can have it both ways, unfortunately. As many things in life, you just can't have it all. Let's keep bribing them. We're getting there, we're getting pretty close, come on. Uh, local authority refuses. Not anymore, they don't. Come on, oh, I don't want that house there. Uh, what else do I need to get rid of? I think that will be all, right? So I can get like a uh, quick overpass around here. I think that should be enough. Oh, you never got the uh, maglev option? Yeah, I think maglev is introduced around 2001. So if you never made it that far in the game, then yeah, you can't do maglev. And that is on the vanilla game. Uh, I think I got maglev in the 70s in this particular game that we're playing right now. Uh, I want to delete more things, come on. Let's start working on the approach here. So, I have... I'm gonna have four tracks. Are we on a slope here? We're kind of on a slope, unfortunately. Train 9 is lost. Did, for whatever reason, trains on this on this line always get lost every once in a while. I don't, I'm not entirely sure what's up with that. It's just a thing that happens. Uh, let's think about what we're gonna do on this side.
We don't have a whole lot of room, and these two cities are kind of growing fast, so that uh, might be an issue here. But I think I'm going to need a overpass of sorts around here as well. Can I get rid of this? I can. Cool. So let's do that. And uh, let's see. Let's keep bribing that. There we go. Now we're screwed. So now we have to wait a whole bunch. Or give them trees, but they already have tons of trees. So I don't think that's going to help a lot. Uh, in the meantime, let's try to maybe keep uh, getting uh, rid of stuff like this. Actually, we can maybe finally fix this part. So that is good. All we have to do now is just, uh, I guess, come this way. So that's one of the branches. The other one is gonna have to go through all of these houses, unfortunately. Unfortunately for the houses. So we no longer need this one. I guess we could have matching bridges, so let's go ahead and do that real quick. There we go. Sweet. So that eventually is going to be connected like that. In fact, this track, I guess it's fine, but I actually want it to go like this. So it's like perfectly parallel to the road. We just need to get rid of this stupid house. Also, we should do that. And do that. There we go. And not necessarily do that, but do this one instead. Just like a regular block signal. And we might as well put another path signal there. Alright. So far so good. This will be eventually connected here. We're going to get rid of this segment, but we definitely need to get rid of this house and that piece of road. And slowly but surely, things are shaping up. All right, let's get rid of that. Oh man, they they got the... Uh, I was going to say they got the road immediately, but no, I think the road was already there. want to get rid of it. Come on. Cool. Does that mean that I can delete this now? I can delete that now. So now we just have the house in the middle. Did you see that? Uh, there's like a photo f somewhere in China of like people that refuse to like move for like a freeway or an avenue. And it's like a six lane freeway that has like a house in the middle and like like all the lanes sort of narrow. And you have to like go around this house in the middle of the freeway. Very interesting. I don't know. It looks like fake, but I think it's actually not fake. Uh, most likely to take a detour head into the depot for service and then haven't taken into account they get lost yeah 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 yeah. i think it's because yeah that's a good symptom that maybe my depot placement is not is not optimal there if they're getting lost all the time train so and so is getting lost uh, it's getting old very old okay let's uh let's fix that real quick so sort by age so Vienna coal. So all of these guys are getting pretty old. Uh, let's get them uh, replaced with, uh, let's see, which one? I think this is the one we were using. They weren't making a lot of profit and this is just gonna really hurt. 
because uh, 71,000. Hybrid switcher. Let's switch it with this one. I don't need them to be super fast, I don't think. Because, I mean, look at the difference in cost. It's like literally twice as much. This one is even cheaper than the ones we already have. So send for servicing. So that should take care of that. Uh, what else? So these are the only three that uh, are now doing super hot. That's all right. Dude, I love this is like a sight to see. Everything is like super smooth coming in and out. I love it. And here is a mess. But it's, it's, it's a mess that we're slowly cleaning up. So that's good. Local authority refuses. Okay, let's see if we can bribe them again. No, we cannot. But we're mediocre. Mediocre is good. Let's give them some, some tree love. Especially around this area. That is not going to affect us so much. What about now? Still mediocre. Damn. Uh, I think mediocre is good enough that we can place a uh, a depot. Uh, sorry, uh, a shipping thing, ferry service between Reykjavik and Chicago. That will have a, that will give us a uh, bit of a boost in reputation. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. Uh, we're gonna go into this thing. I wish that I could rotate the camera, but I I can't unfortunately. <laughs> so. Uh, I guess it really doesn't matter where we put it because everything is like already pretty good, but I guess we can put it there and we can perhaps put the dock in there. You can't even see it, but it's there. So let's go to Reykjavik and Reykjavik has this little slope there. Great. You can't see the thing either, but it's fine. We're gonna put the depot there. These water depots are not very good looking, unfortunately, but it really doesn't matter. So I feel like the obvious thing here will be to get some uh, some passenger ferries, but uh, sorry, ferries, not ferries. Uh, let's sort by capacity because the distance is so so small that it really doesn't uh, matter. So this one can do 250, 800. Kind of want to do this one. Um, sort by capacity. Where is it? Cargo capacity. It is super slow though, but yeah, I guess I guess we want fast, right? Uh, so this one. Sort by speed then. <laughs> Maximum speed. Obviously this one, 112 kilometers an hour, 91, 74. Yeah, but this one can carry twice. Let's do this just for fun because I always use the hovercraft, which is the vanilla one. Uh, you, sir, are going to go from this dock to this other dock, which happens to be invisible. And uh, also, actually, yeah, um, when I put this in a group, so let's create a new group. This will be passengers, uh, Chicago to Reykjavik. Uh, I don't know how to spell Reykjavik. So let's see it. Reykjavik. I'm not gonna do the tilde because I have an English keyboard. I know it's like alt 160 something, but fine. Uh, oh, we need to actually add it to the group. So Chicago to Reykjavik, there we go. So clone ship one, two, three, four, five, six. There we go, that works out. And off they go. So the first one is gonna be empty. The second one is gonna have eight. The third one is gonna have eight. Fourth one, come on. 47 and it's getting higher and higher 11 what about you two okay fine oh i should have uh, connected this too dang it okay wait let's let's do that uh let's get rid of this dock go here and uh let's put the dock connected to i think this is reykjavik central let's try that again now we're talking so now 
we have shared orders. Instead of going to the docks, you're going to go to Reykjavik Central. Sweet. Got to live in seven minutes. New. Well, don't worry. You can watch this uh, stream later on my YouTube channel, youtube.com slash toaster. For those of you who are just joining on Twitch, never been to my channel, by the way, this, uh, what I'm working on right now, is part of a series. So you can go uh, bench watch a whole bunch of episodes in glorious 4K 60 FPS, by the way, um, if that's more like your champ. For some reason, I'm streaming at 1440p, which is not, shouldn't be the case, but. Um, uh, yeah, you can go uh, watch uh, all of my episodes. And I also have some City Skylines videos as well that you might be interested in. So just something to keep in mind. But if you do know about my series and you do know about my channel, also know that uh, this is going to be uploaded as a VOD probably tomorrow or the day after. I might shop this into like multiple episodes because um, uh, some people complain that they don't want to watch like a one or two hour live stream. So far, we've been streaming for two and a half hours. So there's that. And, uh, yeah. Can we get rid of this? Yes. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. So, we can finally get rid of this stupid thing. And all we need next is just some uh, some signals, like that. Pretty straightforward. So the Western branch is pretty much done. Now we need to prettyfy, continue to destroy Chicago and like make it all pretty, which is proving to be a difficult task. Come on, I just deleted that. Jeez. Can I delete anything more here? I deleted something, I got some money back, but I don't know what it was. Probably maybe another tile that I actually had that now it's, yeah, fine. Oh, you're so kind, Pink the Net. Thank you so much. <laughs> uh, Hydronin, hey, how's it going? Um, uh, did you send out the going uh, live tweet two hours ago or so? Because I only just got uh, got got it via Twitter about ten minutes ago. Uh, no, I haven't tweeted in like an hour or so. Uh, the problem with Twitter recently is that. Um, it doesn't show you the latest tweets. It shows you the whatever they think are the tweets that you want to see. And even if you switch it to latest tweets uh, every couple of days, they switch it back because they're freaking a-holes. Uh, I hate it. I hate, like, it's fine. I, I understand that they do it because they have some metrics where engagement increased, but, like, I don't want to see Twitter like that. I've been on Twitter since 2007. I never... I'd never want to see it like that. In fact, uh, whenever I don't notice it, it's just odd. It's like I'm seeing like this tweet is from like a day ago. What? It, what is like? Oh God! It switched again. Like I'm not interested. For me, the whole fun of Twitter is just seeing what I see and what I miss. It's gone. It's missed. Whatever. So uh, yeah. Uh, but that's a good reminder that I should probably send out a tweet from my uh, stream deck right here that I'm still live. That I never use because <laughs> I never stream recently for some reason for many reasons actually anyways uh, this is looking pretty good actually uh, just want to get this fixed up all of this it's pretty decent I don't think I need to uh, I love how there's like a building in the middle of the station here look at this it's pretty cool it's really really nice um, all this is, is looking great. I think eventually we're gonna connect it to uh, Buenos Aires here, have a, a branch going that way. But uh, I don't honestly, I don't think I'm gonna make Hamburg any bigger than what it already is. So I might start getting rid of uh, some of these things. Famous last words, but uh, sure, let's do it. Let 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 Hamburg grow. Let it spread the wings. Actually, let's make it pretty for a second here. Let's. Uh, 
get some roads in place so that it doesn't grow in like random directions. I know that I wanna have a overpass here, maybe a brick one, so that it looks a little nicer. In fact, ah, oh, let's do this. Um, oh, never mind. I was gonna say maybe we can have like a like a bridge over there, but yeah, that's not gonna work. Um, and now this is not gonna work either. So let's get that fixed. Let's get that connected. And over here, I have no clue how I want these to be connected as well. I guess we can just do that. And we can do that. Maybe keep those tiles there for a second. Actually, is there any like parking lot tiles that we can add? Because it would be nice to have like a little uh, parking lot back there, like go full city skylines on us. Uh, so if we go to fixtures, I think I've seen, I mean, they're kind of industrial looking ish, but I mean, it could work. Stations, fixtures, raw materials, process. There's like things like this. I'm pretty sure I remember seeing some parking spaces. I guess there's like trucks. Uh, we can put like one of these. So now there's like a big gap here. Uh, let's see, how can we fill this in with something interesting? Uh, what if we do like an entrance like that perhaps? And uh... <laughs> city stations, yeah, none of these will look good on this uh, theme right here, but Uh, yeah, I don't know. Um, I thought we had, like, more things. I guess we could put some, like, parked trucks that will be obviously facing the wrong way. Oh, there you go. That's kind of a parking lot. Just something to look at. It's not amazing, but... I think, oh, mail, the bags of mail. Dude, that actually makes sense. Yeah, you would have something like that. Why not? Oh, and, and this wants to like grow this way, which is a bad thing. So we want to block this. And maybe get rid of that. And actually do the same thing over here. So let's get rid of this. And put a signal so that the city doesn't grow this way. Because we don't want the city to grow that way. Now we got these like crosswalks, which are, I guess, okay, but... If we do them here, it would match this entrance. So at least that would look a little bit nicer and we can do something like that as well. Now we have some extra buildings here which will increase our our station, uh, whatever, capacity. Not capacity, but just like more people will be coming in. I don't know, that looks kind of nice. Uh, let's just uh, bring a, like a little uh, cul-de-sac over there. That might be a bit too much. Let's just have it end like that, a dead end street. Hopefully some buildings will grow on that, on that spot. All right, cool. Let's see, can we keep deleting things in Chicago? We can, just maybe only one or two. We can delete roads now, which is also pretty good. That uh, ferry service thing I think is paying off. Any more roads, anything else that I can delete? Seems like, oh, there's like a park there, okay. Um, we'll also have to do this uh, in uh, Reykjavik. Unfortunately, this is gonna be interesting. I might do this off camera, to be honest. Well, actually, Reykjavik, it's pretty good, as it is. 
Though we can add, we could potentially add a few more uh, extra lanes here, so sure, why not? At least it's easier here, I believe. Yeah, I'm able to get rid of more things much more easily here. Uh, the issue with Reykjavik is that uh, we're going to have some issues regarding the exit points because there, like, there's like a choke point here. And now we're going across two different things. Yeah, that's going to be a whole thing. What about the lone house at the new tracks? Uh, it's gone. You mean the, the one that we had here? It's totally gone, thankfully. Uh, how are we doing, Chicago? Still obviously not liking me, I'm assuming. Let's see if we can finally bribe you again. Keep. We'll delete more roads. Slowly but surely. So whenever we hit good, we can delete two buildings. So that's good. See, we're slowly buying our, our way into success. <laughs> or bribing our way into success. Run out of water. I might have to even move this station like two tiles that way so that we can have like a nice flat sort of exit point. Uh, this theater thing will have to be removed, forcefully removed. Let's keep bribing. So now we can start planning our, our tracks a little bit. So something like that. So this is going to be one of the tracks. This is going to be another one of the tracks. Uh, we're not going to connect that one just yet. But that's sort of the idea here. Uh, we need to get rid of that, and we're screwed again. <laughs> so we have to do a little, a little waiting. But it's not too bad. So I think we can keep the station where it is. So yeah, obviously we won't be able to add any more platforms because the reputation is poor now. How are these boats doing? Are they making any money or something like that? They are making quite a bit of money, actually, so... How many passengers do we have waiting here? Quite a few. There's definitely a lot more on this side. Uh, in the meantime, let's plan uh, the... Uh, the entry point slowly but surely we have we have the resources and the space to do so so i think that will require me to move this track one tile here you're gonna see why in just a second so let's get rid of this land which obviously it's not going to help for our reputation actually we should probably keep this open so that we know when they like us again There we go. And uh, let's connect this here. And disconnect this for a second. To that, get rid of this middle track. So what I'm thinking is, uh, let me see, uh, I wanna 
do this. I want to do... Actually, we can just do... That? No. Well, for now, let's just do a bridge. But I kind of want to do a tunnel instead. Anyways, we can just do... This. Like that. Like that. Like so. And uh, we can just do that. So I want to keep like all these tracks like very like sort of fit together. And uh, somehow we're gonna loop around, perhaps as far as here. Well, we're allowed to keep deleting things, that's good. And then... Is it raining? Something's weird outside. It's like, it's super cloudy. Uh, it's, it's been, like, weird. Because, like, it shouldn't be raining in this part of the world for, like, a couple months. But it rained, like, this week, so it's weird. Um, can we get rid of this? Perhaps. No. But at least we got one tile. Can we increase that? Um, barely. I mean, this might be enough if we can just cut through this part. In fact, we can go full viaduct like we did in uh, Capital City. That would be amazing, actually. Uh, what's the, where will be the middle of the block? It will be here. So maybe not so much. I think I want to buy all this land first and then figure out what the nicest, you know, most good looking. Uh... Yeah, I, I pretty much own half of Chicago. That's very true. <laughs> uh, this track. Now I can't. I should have not laid down track because then the CD will start building on it, and it won't let me delete my own track, uh, but that's okay. Uh, still can't buy them, so... There's also like a big factory in the middle that could probably not exist. It's almost like perfectly centered too. But anyways, I, I like this approach, it's kind of like clean and nice. Uh, we can get rid of that too, because maybe this could be our depot thing. Uh, is it uh, long enough? It's perfect, actually. So let's go ahead and do that. So trains needing servicing can just go out on this branch. And uh, we could help Chicago a little bit and just uh, give them a nice uh, little tunnel so that the city can grow. I'd rather have the track going on this on this uh, segment right here so hmm suddenly so it doesn't look like uh, we have much space for the depots but maybe we can do something about that. We can honestly just do this. This is tricky. Okay, now I'm allowed to bribe them again. Awesome. So we have that, and uh, this is gonna get removed. Just to be sure, we're gonna rebuy the land, because you never know when they're gonna put a house in there, and then we're gonna have to do all this again. Still can't get rid of roads, but I can get rid of that road. So, you know, baby steps. Bribe the authorities. And 
And there we go. We're getting uh, we're getting closer for sure. So if we go viaduct style again. We can do something like this. As far as uh, depots go, I think we can put the depots over on this side, like right there, actually. We can start adding signals. Like that and like that. So trains have options to either go to the depot or just to go to this track and uh, we're gonna have to get rid of all these houses, unfortunately for them. So this is where the, uh, yeah, this is actually perfect because then we have this line and they're gonna all branch out from here. It's gonna be, it's gonna be perfect. Uh, did you play A Train as well back in the day? I sank too many hours in that and TTD. Um, I haven't played A Train. Um, I've seen, uh, like I've, I've had friends of mine played it for me like explain what it is, but there was like too much overhead for for me. Um, I think it was like in uh, Japanese, right? Uh, half of the UI is in Japanese, or it wasn't like properly translated. That that didn't help. Uh, let's take a look uh, at Capital City real quick, see how it's doing. Oh, we're growing, like, actually, like, good growing. So, engineering supplies. Wait. Oh, okay, so engineering supplies is next. So now we need to deliver food. Damn, all right, so... <sighs> things are things are getting more interesting now, for sure. Look, we have uh, more more houses on the other side of our viaduct here. So pretty. Um, let me think for, for a moment. Okay, so mediocre. Let's keep bribing these guys. Oh, actually, we need to, like, we need to get rid of all of these houses. We're, we're getting there. We're getting there. One bribe at a time. So, I think this is where our track sort of comes down. So there will be like a bridge here. So that will be the first step down. Right. Or, we can do this. So this is the first step down and we bridge this gap with a bridge. Like so, actually you need the concrete one because it's fast. So now the city can have its road back because we're nice neighbors, obviously. Everyone knows that. There we go. I'm giving your city back, uh, Chicago, like I promise. Uh, so at this level... I guess we could just... Stay like this? Cuz yeah... Yeah, I guess this is fine. Uh, we can get a couple more of those. Honestly, I don't think we're gonna need these, but just in case... We're gonna purchase the land again. Until I'm sure that this is the design that I wanna go with. Uh, here for sure we wanna go down. Cause this is where all the lines are gonna be merging from. Something like that. I'm, I'm sure you can get a picture of uh, what I'm aiming for. And honestly, we can just uh, get rid of this stuff. 
So let's put one way path all the way in here. And we can get rid of this, and all 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 of this. Alright, so that's uh, this part of the setup cleaned up. There we go. Uh, can we get rid of this road? We can. So now we can finally put this back together. Uh, we can also do this for... Nope, not for this, but for road vehicles. Have like a nice uh, concrete viaduct. Uh, this train is somehow lost because of this. And now it's no longer lost. There we go. Sweet. So now, basically, what's in the way right now is these two buildings. We need to get rid of these buildings. So let's keep uh, bribing away. That one is now gone. I think here I'm just gonna do that. And now there's only one more building that now it's gone to. Can I go? One tile deeper, yes. All right. <sighs> That's our line. It was in full English on the Amiga. Oh, interesting. Oh, I think uh, the one that I was shown was like A9, which was part of the A Train series, but like maybe one of the later games. I didn't know that it was actually that old. Interesting. The more you know. All right, so. Let's uh, hook this all up. For a moment here, we're gonna stay on this branch here. And uh, we need to connect this one here. So one, two, three, four, five. Okay, perfect. Uh, let's get rid of this uh, road. That was uh, forced upon myself. Oh, we have a Chinese maglev. We're good, but thank you. Appreciate it. Um, I guess over here we can give them a nice little overpass as well, a concrete overpass. And over here, uh, we can have a grade crossing. It really doesn't matter. Same here. Uh, here we should probably want to erase this. In fact, we might want to erase it even here as well. That way they can get a road that pretty much reaches all the way to the end. Uh, please stop creating roads. God dang it. Okay, fine. I'm trying to like organize your city. You're not allowing me to. I understand why, but like, come on should know that my intentions are mostly good by now. Uh, I don't necessarily think I need any more signals here, but just for good measure, let's just add them. Actually, you should probably put them here. It's gonna cause less issues. All right, cool. So uh, let's finally, this is all connected right now, right? So they should be able to just go that way if I simply remove this. Let's see what happens. Have a giant backup of trains because oh, they're being sort of broken down. Uh, I just remember, are you excited about smart layouts coming to Figma? If I can very happy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, yes. I've, I've seen their tweet. Um, like, they, I saw, like, a little gif that they posted. It's great. Uh, I think, uh, didn't Sketch, like, add it, like, a month or two ago? And I used to be, like, all up in Sketch, but I, when I had to switch to Windows for a while, 
and not being able to it's just like you're done you're dead to me sketch <laughs> like it's it was a great product it still is but and and i understand why they focus so much on mac but like come on yeah figma like destroy them i feel like that's why uh competition is good for uh consumers <laughs> finally uh i don't think Will that work? I don't know if that will work. Um, I guess we can just do that, and that will be a dead end, and uh, that's... Yep, yeah, it is what it is. Just in case we're gonna... buy this land for a second. I don't know what's going to happen if I don't, but I don't want to regret it later because I don't want to keep bribing these people if I can avoid it. There we go. All right, so trains are coming into Chicago. That's pretty good, except uh, we don't have a station here. So, yeah, well, now we need to actually work on the station. But we're almost done. We're almost done, and it's great. And we're in mediocre mode, so let's go city stations, and let's get some city stations. Number of tracks and platform size. I think that's about right. So, come on. Man, these trains keep breaking down all the time. Let's close Capital City here for a moment. Come on, go, 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 go. There we go. So let's make this pretty now. What if we go three length, like right in the middle, do something like that. And this could be something like that. I hope this is actually connected. It looks connected, but we've been proven wrong about that before. So, uh, all right. You're good, Chicago. Thank you for letting me destroy you. How are we doing here? We're doing amazing, right? Very good. Not amazing? Just very good. Oh, because we have a lot of passengers here. Yeah. This is going to be... This is going to be interesting. But uh, given how I've been uh, streaming for about three hours, I think I'm going to wind things down. There's still some improvement that could be done here. Why are these trains not going this way, though? Okay, some of them are. I guess maybe that platform was, was full, but, uh, yeah. Yeah, we have a lot of, uh, we're operating at capacity here. We might need to, uh, add at least two more platforms. And I might need to get rid of this hotel, to be honest. The problem is that I don't think I can delete this hotel. Yikes. Just want to keep things symmetrical, you know? But, uh, uh, yeah, I think, uh, I think I'm going to wrap this one up. Uh, I'm first going to say goodbye to the people... Oh, sorry, goodbye uh, to the people on uh, YouTube watching this uh, VOD. Uh, if you enjoyed these uh, set of videos, please uh, give them a like. And if you're new to your channel, uh, I don't know why you'll be watching this super long live stream if you're new to my channel, but hey, uh, just subscribe. That way you get uh, notified. But uh, yeah, that's all I have for you And in terms of this video. Thank you for watching and hope to see you in the next one.